keep an eye on it for me. Of course. Where are you going? Somewhere that's not here. Look, I've got 30 quid. Are you happy now? You got what you wanted, he's going, you've driven him out. I never meant... Oh, just shut your mouth! Don't you ever speak to me again. Don't you even look at me and Jason. And whatever twisted little plan you're thinking up next, you drop it. Because I am warning you, you little bitch. You might be able to get rid of him, but you will never be rid of me. And I hope that your daughter causes you as much pain and suffering as I'm feeling now. I'm going, Sarah. I hope you find someone who loves you as much as I did. Bye, Mum. Jason, do something! He's going! No way. This is your fault! I will never forgive you! It's not my fault. Don't let me cramp your style. If you see anyone you fancy, just tip me the wink and I'll disappear. With the day. <laughs> you never know. Oh, I'm not. Dignity at all times. There's no need for that, is there? No need for what, exactly? That look you gave Sarah just now. I'd have thought she was the injured party, if anybody was. It's OK. She not told you the latest? Mum, leave it. What latest? How she turned up this morning in my son's bed. Oh. Not Todd, though, no. This time, she fancied a change, so it was Jason's bed that the little trollop worked her way into, with the result that Todd's gone and I might never see him again, which is exactly what she wanted, wasn't it? No, Sarah, you didn't. Oh, yes, you did. Surprised, are you, Gail? Surprised that poor, innocent little Sarah Louise could do something so darn right wicked? <laughs> do you know what? I feel embarrassed for you, girl. I really do. I mean, the way you look down your nose at Todd, accusing him of all sorts. Well, not anymore. Because my Todd is a much better person than you or your daughter could ever hope to be. Change my mind. Going home. Whatever Madam wants. Hi, Sarah. Hi. Sarah? You weren't deliberate. It wasn't like she said. It, it wasn't for revenge. Yeah, but not telling me were deliberate, weren't it? Stealing him from underneath my nose and then lying your head off about it. Do you know what? I think she's right. I think you're a dirty little trollop. Oh, Sarah. I'm sorry. 